Presiding Judge Remy Kasule ruled that granting the interim order to stop Wednesday's nomination exercise would be putting a stop on the world election process, yet is scheduled to end in February 2016. Justice Kasule also noted that since presidential candidates have already paid the increased fee of 20 million shillings and have already embarked on their campaign trail, it would be an injustice to out the election process by now. The judge advised the petitioners, including members of the Conservative Party and youths from the inter-party platform, to pursue the main application in which court may grant appropriate orders on merit. However, the applicants were dissatisfied with the decision and vote to appeal the ruling in the Supreme Court. They deny Ugandans their right to be represented. And why is it that, why is it that it is now? You cannot make an increment of 500%. This is unacceptable. What we are going to do, we need justice in, in Supreme Court. Justice in Supreme Court. The applicants petitioned court over the amendment that hiked nomination fees for members of parliament from 200,000 to 3 million, something that is contested as aiming to ring fence parliament for the wealthy. Why should government eh, close the doors? Government doesn't want us to come on board. The nomination exercise for parliamentary candidates is scheduled for the 2nd and 3rd of December under the newly passed amendments to the Parliamentary Election Act.